Carol. I don't even know how to like introduce Carol. Miss Carol. Carol, 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 where are you, my friend? I'm great. My my friend Carol is one of my master teachers and Reiki masters. She's a multi-dimensional energy expert. She's here today to help you elevate and bring you to a calibration that you never experienced before. She's a born empath, fully sentient, medium healer, remote viewer, you, you, we see Reiki and other modality, transformational modalities. She's a mentor who stars, who mentors star seeds and pure spiritual spiritualist who ex experiences a human life. <laughs> this is like, like, I can't even spit, spit this out. You know, like Carol has been telling us this is her first life in this being so it's hard for me to like read this like someone who's never been here before and this is her like her bio this is carol's first life um hey i don't know how many lives we've been but this is like carol i welcome you and i honor you and i respect you so come on board my friend come play with us come hang out with us for the rest of the night you got the stage for the next 30 minutes. You're the one and only one who guarantees the work that you do. You're like, you're like, you, you just like, you adopted this new little doggy. who will look exactly like you, honestly. <laughs> you know, it's so, it's so cute. I, I hopefully that you will share your dog picture. With Here us. she is. Here <laughs> she is. Yeah, she's Venusian. And that's her name, Nusha. Okay, Nusha. sweetie. So go, go play. Come say hello to the people. Come say hello. Here she is. <laughs> Here she is. Miss, yes, Miss Venusha herself. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a life a life changing experience for you, huh? Oh, she's she's amazing, and uh, she's an ET. <laughs> It's like, who, please who share with adopted us who? what do you want to share with us today and just go for it, Carol. Right okay, here. what I want to share with you today, um, the theme is always about time because time is so different now than it used to be. And this is going to be channeled, obviously. Uh, and um, yeah, to talk about time is to talk about the 3D and what everybody is experiencing, but on a physical level. And so to explain it from the other side, I'm going to have to shift a little bit here. So um, let's just channel in my higher self. And um, I'll be able to share a little bit more. So thank you everyone for sticking around. It's a long day, Sherry, thank you. Thank you again for doing this selfless, selfless work, giving us all a platform. And so now let us all connect together. Father, Mother, God, thank you for everything that you have given us and continue to give us. We call upon our guides, our angels, our master teachers, master healers, all those of the light and only of the light to be here now. And we call upon the gatekeepers, please take your positions. And everyone who is listening, who is here tonight, and all those who will listen to this audio in the future, are being now assigned two gatekeepers. One to remain with the physical body, and the other to go with the astral body in times of meditation, prayer, sleep, and dream time. 
so that you may return into your physical body purified and cleansed of any anything that is less than light. And so now we call upon our beautiful friends, the Venusians, who will come to talk to you about time, timing, and about the recalibration. We thank you for having connected with each other. You know, we are all one. We are all here to experience love on a higher, on a higher level, on the highest level. And that includes change and much change is happening. And so to speak tonight about time, once again, because time is so elusive. You wake up in the morning, you have a cup of coffee, all of a sudden it's time for bed. There's just seemingly no time to accomplish. That is because now the choice is yours. Awareness is expanding to bring awareness for more change to humanity. And so awareness is the key word that we would like you to adopt and to write down and to, to meditate on this word, awareness. because awareness will bring you to a place inside of you that we call consciousness. And in this place, there is no time, there is choice. And the choice now is up to each individual to focus on What makes you happy? And it is very simple. Letting go of the ego mind. That is where time exists. 24 hour day, 12 month year, et cetera, et cetera timing and this is elusive because of the gravity that is found in the third dimensional world of earth which is necessary to experience what humanity is experiencing. Humanity is a dream. It is just one of many dreams. And so if you realize that you have chosen to experience pain, your awareness will advise you of such of any lack, it is but a dream because you believe you need to learn something. What if we are to tell you that you are already perfect, but you have forgotten because that was part of the plan to incarnate one time or many times. And many of the star seeds are beginning to remember who they are. 
more and more people are having their first incarnations as a human, in human form. And this does not intend that there was no life before. There are many, many waves of consciousness, of vibratory rates. And so many forms of consciousness means that the spirit who is a celestial, for example, we have competition here. Celestials who have chosen to experience human form will have as well as star seeds who have not experienced emotions will have a tough time. There are many who have become addicted to different modalities to numb the emotions because emotions are very strong when you have no tools to deal with emotions. And so many of the celestials have eating disorders, for example, or addicted to different things. And so all of this is to bring you back to time. And there is only time when you are in your mind, in your head, when you're thinking. And we confirm that so many, for so many years now, that there have been many people, many races, many extraterrestrial beings talking about moving into your heart space. Now it is imperative so that you can choose to experience silence by letting go of what is the third dimension, including fear. And so with the recalibration that we have chosen to bring you is basically to separate the ego mind during a few days to give you enough of the experience so that you can realize the awareness of being, of living your life without focusing on your past because the ego mind is always in the past and very judgmental. And when you are in your heart space, there is no judgment. And so to raise your vibratory rates very fast because it has come to the stage of the game of life that humanity must change. That is why there are so many star seeds and so many celestials here in body to help humanity. And more specifically in the peninsula of Florida, there are many light workers because of the, the water element that elevates the frequencies. 
And so with all the changes that are being <clears throat> experienced, there is help. Know that you are not alone. You are never alone. Because there is so much love around you. And so many people are experiencing, even the light workers, even those who have chosen the spiritual path, they're experiencing lack, which we are acknowledging now that there is a balance that needs to be created, a balance to bridge the spirituality with the emotions, the emotional body, the mental body. Because there is no lack. There is abundance all around you. All around all of us. Because source is infinite. And that is where we all come from. We are all infinite. And so by focusing on lack you create more of it whatever you create whatever you are creating is is because you are manifesting what you think what you choose that is familiar and so it is the familiar that feels comfortable that is in the time and time is being used and abused as an excuse. Oh, I don't have time for this today. Well, it is time to put yourself as a priority because of what you have chosen to bring to humanity, you must Raise your frequency for yourself to allow more energy to flow through you. And this energy is light and light is information. And this light is moving through all of your cells, atoms and molecules. And being activated activating now through your spinal column <laughs> through your spine more competition we have so much competition here tonight and so we apologize <laughs> We had to throw her a tissue box. You got it, sweetie. No problem. Got it. Need to get out of my. He threw a whole box of tissue. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I heard children do. They want mommy's attention. And so we, we have come at this time to also give you so much love an acceptance of everything that you have done, that you are and that you will experience in the future. Because now we know that you are in very accelerated time, very accelerated energy frequencies. And the shift 
in which you find yourselves as a humanity, and especially for those of you who are, who have chosen the knowledge and activate your God selves through your energy bodies called chakras and all of your cells, each cell is a chakra and the light is coming in through the subatomic levels now. And that is why many of you are feeling off. Some of you are feeling bipolar at times on this roller coaster ride. And we say, take the time to rest. You won't need days or weeks to rest. You can rest 20 minutes. And this rest is to let go, to let go of the mind, of the to-do list, of all of your responsibilities in the third dimensional world and to focus on your light, on your connection with your divinity, on your connection with your higher self. This is the most important thing for you to do now. To make source the love of your life. Welcome to Saturday Night Live. Here we go. What else could we throw? <laughs> Love it, Carol. Love it. I'm a ventriloquist. Did you know? <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Woof. Who would ever think you'd be a dog lover? <laughs> she never does that. Please believe me. Okay. There's other people in the room that can channel your dog right now. Okay. Let's breathe, release. Yes, they're everywhere. Today and this evening, for everyone who is here, is quite a celebration. And it is not just the celebration of the last day of October, because that is from many years, many years of holding in reverence Mother Earth, and the moon and the sun and the sacrifices that were made to create the medicine and the hope for a new humanity. Now we are here and so many of our brothers and sisters are here through human bodies, human physiques, to help each other to become aware of the light that is. It just is. The isness of life is acceptance. And to accept is to allow everything that you have in your life, everything, what you like and what you don't like, what you love and what you hate, what you believe you hate. I hate getting up early in the morning. Well, 
one day you won't have to wake up in the morning. You may have to wake up at night. Just allowing. Because now is the time to surrender, to surrender to the breath. Because the breath is life. Remember, you may not remember the first breath you took into your physical body to experience this life that you are in now. And this life was breathed into you and continues to be breathed into you by source. And so source is what everyone needs to make the love of your life with gratitude, saying thank you. Thank you for every breath. Thank you. Gratitude. And gratitude brings abundance. And you will begin to realize that there is no lack in your life. It was only in your mind. Activate the worthiness in your first chakra. You are worthy of everything that exists in this dream. You are worthy. It is because you believe you are not. And become aware of the stories that you believe are true that have created lack in your life, a lack of worth, worthiness, a lack of health, because of the anger you are still holding and harboring inside of you, let it go, it isn't worth it. It's time for you to rejoice, to be happy, to feel free. And this is the freedom that we are all here to help you with because you have never experienced freedom as a humanity. There was always a faction to dominate the populations. Thousands of years of this. And so now it is almost over. And this golden age is the fifth and higher of the dimensions, which is in consciousness. And so you must believe, you must bring your consciousness to this level of vibration. Nobody is coming to save you. Do not wait for the politicians to change. Do not wait for the doctors to find the miracle pill. You are it. You are source. You have everything to succeed, whatever that may be for you. You are each unique because of the perception on how you see your life, the people in your life that you have attracted the opportunities and the lack in your life that you have created. Now is the time for you to create a new and to create a new life for yourself is always begins in the mind. Look for new mantras. We have some here for you. I attract only loving and supportive people in my life. And if you repeat this constantly mentally throughout the day, throughout the night, whenever you awaken, whenever you drive your car, continuously repeat this new mantra. Your perception will change and you will be more accepting of the people in your life. You yourself will become more loving and accepting, non judgmental of yourself and others. 
and the people in your life that you have been allowing to love you falsely so that you could feel whatever you thought you needed to feel by these people who were not loving will change for, for people who are sincere. I attract only loving and supportive people in my life. And this worthiness will allow you to create more. People will be coming into your life, showing you your worth, telling you your worth, because you will start to perceive yourself differently. so that you can increase your prices, your fees comfortably. So when you raise your frequency and you will allow your higher self to tell you to raise your prices for different things, for different services, you will do so with confidence. And your regular clients and your new clients will not say anything negative to you because they know your worth. Offer a payment plan if, if needed. Only in rare occasions because if you offer a payment plan, it means that you are attracting people who also believe in lack. So now is the time to release all time in your mind, in your head, saying, oh, I used to, in the past, I used to charge this, I used to do this, I used to say this. You've heard of the present moment, now is the time, now is the time to be present. And to be present is to be aware of your thoughts, to be aware of your emotions and allow this to be, to allow, allow you to be what is going on to become aware without judgment. Feeling sad, you feel sad, feel sad. And you will move straight through it. You feel angry? Well, you have probably been carrying this anger for a very long time. Breathe through the anger, feel it and breathe through it and know that you are safe. This is something that everyone needs to feel safe, regardless of what is going on around you. You must feel safe knowing that you are limitless. And so the recalibration that we offer is to align you with all 13 chakras. You know the first seven, then there are channel number eight, nine and 10 is above your crown chakra. Two golden orbs of light, 11 and 12, that go into each knee so that this energy will move through your legs and through your lower body to create a momentum because your physical body is the result of thought, of the divine thought. And so your legs represent moving into your future. 
And this will allow you to move abundantly into a future, your future. And finally, the 13th chakra is a beautiful mossy green golden orb of light below your feet. And this is what allows your physicality to feel, to know, and to tell you what it needs on each given day. Or whenever there is a fluctuation or a shift in energy frequency, because your body needs to adjust. And so one day it may need more calcium. It may need more iron, it may need copper, it may, need, you need to listen. And if you feel like eating something out of the blue, let's say, that is funny, out of the blue, to listen to your body. This doesn't mean that you need to change your eating habits. Just to listen to your body when it gets a craving, for example, just a taste of this, a bite, or it could be a beverage as well, or just a sip is enough to raise your frequency. And this is one of many different um, things that we will be doing in your session. And the well being, the continuous well being of this change will be shifting between three and four days after the actual session, which is done remotely over the phone and is being taped. So you will receive an audio of everything that we do. We are very verbal, we are very vocal. And so we like to express everything that we are doing. If only you could see the energy, maybe some of you do, but if you, only you could see the energy as it moves through the physical form, the physical form disappears. All you see are energy and you can see the different forms of light, the different colors. And there are some colors that do not exist in the human spectrum. And all of this is being moved around and shifted and changed so that you could be at your optimum. And so we have been very successful and this can be life altering for some people because you allow all of your, I can't, I don't think so, maybe not, just to be discarded so that you can live your heart's desire. No more fear that you may be hurt if you fall in love another time. To allow yourself to fall in love to allow yourself to start a new business, regardless of your age, regardless of what happened in the past, if it is your heart's desire you visualize and you ask for support, you ask for help in your meditations and meditate daily, even if it's just 10 minutes, meditate daily to find this silence, eventually you will, you will, because you are not of this earth. We send much love to you now and always. And we look forward to meeting each and every one of you. Remember, please, to continue to drink much water, especially with all of this, these changes that are going on within your body, the fascia inside of your physical form. 
is the gateway, the fascia is fluid. The fascia is where all of the information flows. And so people with, for example, fibromyalgia is inflammation of the fascia. Those are people who have not understood what love is and have created a very painful way to learn how to love themselves. And so the physical form is a school it is a school of learning, learning how you are thinking, learning how you are feeling. Whatever health you are in at the present moment is because of your thoughts have been unloving towards yourself and your emotions have been unloving towards yourself. And so become aware of what is going on in you. And you are the only one to change it and you have the tools. You have all the tools and the courage and the strength. No more excuses. We are here to serve. You are complete. If there are any questions, if there are any time, if there is time for questions. That's Carol, you asking for questions? If there is anyone who has, yes, if we have time for questions. Where did you learn that fascia education? It is everywhere. Those learning medicine would throw away this glutinous form. And if you notice when a baby, before the baby starts to form, the gelatinous sac is the fascia. Every single piece of your anatomy is surrounded by this fascia. And it is filled with information of light because the human form is two thirds water like the earth. And so the information, the divine information that is required for you to tap into is coming through the fascia. And this is information from higher sources. The true nature of the physical body has just been told. The true nature is that everything is energy and that the physical body can be transformed with thought and emotion, the mind is the most powerful because the mind is not a physical form. 
the mind is that which is connected, the infinite mind. So when people say open your mind, it means to connect with your divinity. You see. That is why it is so important to drink water, much water, much water, and to exercise, even if it's mild exercise, stretching, for example. If you are in pain, stretch mildly, lovingly. If you can walk, walk. If you can swim, swim. Be gentle. If some people who are listening are already runners, well, listen to your body. This is not the time to force anything, to push. Allow rather than push. And by allowing, you will be gentle and bring your body slowly and gently to its ultimate way of being. Again, it takes patience. And this is what we are discussing this evening. It's about trust. It's about patience, knowing that you are safe. To stop running away from yourself, because all of a sudden you'll see, oops, here I am again. There is no running away. Oops, here I am again. Any other question, please? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do we have any more time or I don't know? Okay, I'm back. Um, I, I don't know what, um, if anybody would like to have a private um, reading with me, I'm in room uh, 11. I think, what was it, did we say 20 minutes? Carol, did you do your uh, giveaway? Did you raffle your gift? No, I did not. That's okay, so let's let's do your raffle. Um, everybody, please write a number from one to one hundred. Carol, how write about, yours. How about one to twenty? There are seventeen people here. Okay, so one to twenty. Yeah, let's make it more dynamic. Okay, so write down your number. One to 20. Yeah, write it down so you can show it to the camera whenever they chose it. The, the things that make sure you don't choose the same number that somebody else put there. Okay, is everybody ready? Okay. Can we have a drum roll? Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead and show your number. Oh, yay. Show your number, love. Carl, show your number to the camera. Well, it's always the same number. Okay, 11. Okay, yeah, so let's see. Room. Okay, so Kat Thomas. Yep. Perfect. Congratulations. So, yay, thank you so much. Okay. So you want to take her right away? So sure. If there aren't uh, any more questions or comments about uh, what the Venusians were talking about and what my little Venusian here was, uh, <laughs> was commenting on with her 
Whoops. I'm here. Did you? I did you see 11? What just happened just now? Yeah. Are you done? If I'm done? Yeah, are you finished? Yeah, I she's done. Oops, my stone. I, I guess so. I, I, I was in communication with someone else. On the Carol, phone. do you have a website to look you up? Oh, yes, of course. What am I thinking? Yeah, let me, chat? yeah, in the, in the, yeah, um, in the end, might as well give you a little bit <laughs> where I can be found. Uh, my website is goddesstouch.net. Goddess so, touch, goddess touch. Yes, G-O-D-D-E-S-S, -S, touch, T-O-U-C-H dot net. And I'm in the Fort Lauderdale area. Um, I work from, um, well, from home, obviously. And also in person um, at Jade Wellness, which is on Oakland Park Boulevard. So if you want to come see me, um, you know, have a person to person. Um, Jade Wellness? Based, yeah, Jade, J-A-D-E, Jade. Jade Wellness. Yeah, that's also that, on my is west. Is that close to Andrews Avenue or is that far out west? Oh, no, no, no. It's east. It's uh, right close to the bridge. It's right before the bridge between... Um, um, Commercial. Bay, Bayview, Bayview Boulevard and something else. No, it's on... No, uh, Jade Wellness is on um, Oakland Park. Eight. Which is between Federal and Bayview. Oh, Federal and Bayview. Okay. Federal yeah. Bayview. Yeah. Yeah. And I hold, uh, I've been holding uh, Reiki circles for like over 20 years. But uh, oh. and now I've changed uh, for the holiday season. I'm, uh, I've shifted. So um, if anyone who wants to receive my newsletters with all of these changes, um, how about you texting me? at um i think that's the best way to do it so you know and just put your name on the thing um nine, nine five four what nine five four six five 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 four nine zero so by texting me and just saying hi carol uh, we we met at we met at the psychic fair yeah, okay, you yeah. In the chat. <laughs> yeah we met psychic fair yeah no really because there's you know i'm getting so many so many um different things you know so in any case um yes there's that so have a look at my website um there's a a detailed um um explanation uh on um, the recalibration there's also something that i do i have to do that i have to do in person because it involves the Young Living Oils, the raindrop therapy that I do. Um, and it's called Clear the Path and it truly clears your path. Um, so it releases a lot of fears that you have. So um, there's Reiki involved. I'm a Reiki master and teacher for over 25 years. So I teach Reiki level one, two, advanced practitioner um, and master and teacher also learn how to attune is very important. Um, and I've also started um, to teach channeling because there are so many people who are blossoming now in their spirituality and they can do it, but they need a little bit of guidance, if you will. And so um, that I've been asked to do for many years and I, I had my first 15 week class uh, and it has been amazing. Now I'm waiting for the transcript of the audio. And so I'm gonna have a, a book to go with that. And um, I'm available for readings by Skype, by Facebook Messenger, by, you know. So there you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. You, you do it on Tuesdays at 12 o'clock, correct? Oh, there's a Zoom at noon, okay. which is a guided meditation. 
Mm -hmm. And Reiki. Zoom at noon every Tuesday. That I am not changing. Um, however, the first, the first Sunday for November and December, we'll see what happens if it brings more people. I'm going to have the Reiki circle on Sunday at 1 p.m. The first Sunday of the month. And Good. then there's and then on the third Sunday of the month, I'm going to have an in-house um, um, recalibration, a group recalibration. And this, the people who have received a recalibration via Zoom when I had the, um, the world healing recalibration, everyone who had a one-on-one -on -one treatment experienced the same thing as if it was one-on-one. -on -one. So it was pretty amazing. These things are pretty amazing. So, you know, I welcome everyone who, you know, who wants to discuss it first, who wants to experience just a five minute um, remote uh, energy work with me, you know. Um, and uh, I guarantee my work. So if uh, the people are, not satisfied, you know, it's just like, don't pay me. I know this stuff works amazingly, <laughs> you know, because they work through me. No, really, they work through me. I, I know my worth because I, you know, I surrender. And so I know that this stuff is like so amazing. It will change anybody to be a, a, a better you. So, you know, if you're not happy for whatever reason, you expected something different, you expect it to stay the same, <laughs> too bad. <laughs> you won't ever be the same after this. And so if you're not happy with that, because it's scary to have, to let go of stuff, just don't pay me, you know, and that's fine. Because everything comes from source anyways, you know. <laughs> So thank you, everyone. And uh, I'm going to my room now. So if anyone wants to join me for a reading or um, anything else, we'll see you soon. No, no, don't go anywhere, Carol. Oh? Where are you, you going to run? What's going on? What? Oh, no, no. This is about us, you know, coming together and just closing out the last hour of the night. Oh, they really? Yeah, and we got one more hour left of the whole night, but they can follow you into your room and have any Q&A, but I'm going to open up the panel to, um, to the practitioners as well as to the, to the, cut and the people and that is here tonight. We have okay. one more hour left of the night. So Carol, thank you for being here. You can oh, stick I'm around. Sure. You can, can hang out. Stick around? Can I well, stick around? Yeah, you can stick around or just go to your room. I'll send you to room with the dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I'm in my room and the dog is right there at my feet. Right there. <laughs> I, I know I'm feeling the whole dog thing. It's kind of funny. And the cat is on the chair right behind the computer. <laughs> That's what the problem was. That's so cute. And I'd like to close out the last hour of the night with, you know, like a recap of the whole night of our you know, what you, what you experience, what you felt, what you want, what you desire, and just kind of open it up. And even if you want to play some music or do a demonstration, you know, you know like, this is like, we, we kind of like little lost track of time tonight, honestly. Um, let, let me just show my video. Go ahead. There is no time, Sherry. Yeah. There is no there time. Is no time. We literally, I, I felt like I lost time track of the whole day. I'm looking down. I'm like, damn, where's the whole day gone? You know, like I spent the whole month planning this and it's like gone. Yeah. So guys, we're here to play. We got one more hour or more, but let's do it. We got, we got planned till 10 o'clock at night. There's a dog. We'd love to see the dogs. Hello, doggy. And, um, and, and to, you know, I, I love doing all that. Hello, Storm. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, Lee. And Leon is still here. It's nine o'clock at night. That's like two o'clock in the morning for you. Yes, yes, I know you're going to like head out. Monique, thank you for being here. Jennifer Clark, I didn't talk to you. Um, Vicky, thank you for being here. My Zoom engineer. 
Michelle and Bobby, thank you for being here. Carol, for being here. Storm, you're always here. Thank you. And anyone who else who is, and Julia, oh, there's Julia. Thank you, there's Julia, awesome. Okay, cool. Guys, we're not going anywhere. It's only nine o'clock. This is early. This is early in, um, like, what else are you gonna do? <laughs> Take what? the dog out for her, her walk. What else are you gonna do? Huh? You know, do, go take Vicky's dog out and go for a walk. Look at the beautiful dog that Vicky has right now. And where's your dog? Let's see your dog. Let's see the beautiful dog that you have, because I think the dog looks exactly like you. Like oh, Vicky. Are you talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking about you. Oh. Yeah, let's see. The your dog, dog looks like me. What do you mean? Yeah, I think your dog looks like you. No, it's true. We have the same hair. Yeah. Yeah, but she doesn't have any glasses. Nusha, come. She's Venusian, by the way. Nusha, come. It's time to get up. Come on, wake up. Nush, Nushi, Nushi, my Nushi, come here. Come here. So come if, you can, if, you, if your dog can sit in the lap like Vilka, I don't know where you're coming from, Vilka. What are you doing to control your dog in your lap right now? Where are you joining us? Oh, from? she's very docile. <laughs> she's a cutie. She's where, where are you joining us from? Texas. Texas. And look at Michelle and Bobby. Look at their doggy right now. Okay. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay. We this is Rolo. Dogs. This is Rolo. He's always, this is like my shadow. <laughs> yeah. Aww. He's Australian Shepherd. Oh, cute. <laughs> Anybody else have any animals? Bring them up to the States. <laughs> I have four of them, but they are sleeping now. Mm. Two dogs, two cats. Four dogs, two cats. Is that what you said? Yes. Four and two. Oh, one good. big one. Oh. One oh. chihuahua. Oh. Oh, it's cool. half a dog, half, half a cat, and two cats. So, and uh, the youngest one uh, is usually sitting on my shoulders. I want to say hi to Kath down there. Hi, and Kath, her cat. and her cat. <laughs> hi, Kath. I love. <laughs> Uh, Hi guys. Yeah, this is my Miss Moxie Creole. I made fish tonight and she's helping me eat it. So. <laughs> she's cute. Thank you. I got I gotta call attention to my cat. Uh does Carol, Elisa, Jennifer, Karen, Maya, anybody else have, have any animals? It's only 10, it's only nine o'clock at night. <laughs>